Up After Effects and bring in your footage. I'm putting a filter on this footage to make it match a shot of Mila Jovovich from one of the movies. It's a preset from Magic Bullet Looks called Warm Bird. This is optional, I just think it looks cooler. Next, create a new adjustment layer and add color balance. Then use the ellipse tool to draw a circular mass in the adjustment layer over your actor's iris. Next, adjust the color balance to get the iris to be the color you want. I started with green and then decided on blue. Once you've done this, you have to get the mass to move with the eyes. You might be able to motion track it, but I can't really do that on this computer. It's kind of old. If you have that same issue, then you'll have to manually manipulate each frame using keyframes. When your actor blinks, you'll also have to drop the opacity down to zero for a frame or two. This is my final result. Here's a side-by-side -side comparison to the original. And here's a close-up cross-section of the iris. To create the umbrella logo, you have to create a new adjustment layer and use the pen tool to literally draw the logo onto the iris. Add color balance to this adjustment layer, and then mess with the settings to make it red. Then bring down the opacity about 25%. This was a lot of keyframing, similar to what I just showed you, so I'm just going to skip to the final result. And there you have it, the Resident Evil iris effect. Now all you need is some creepy background music.